What's up, y'all? This is Joe here at Statesville Mad Vapes. Uh, we're gonna do a getting to know your vape guy twice, second time in a row, because there's so much. I am such an in-depth person. I am not shallow at all. There is a lot to learn. So, I guess when it comes to me and vaping, it's been a battle. Um, I've gone back to cigarettes twice in uh, the almost three years that I've been vaping. Uh, I finally got to a point to where I haven't smoked one in a while. I'm very comfortable without it. Um, and that's because of salt-based nicotine. You probably noticed a ton of the devices I use are um, little small ones that are little mouth to lung hitters. Uh, I'm able to put very high milligram nicotine into it. Uh, they have some excellent tobacco flavors and that to me is just it just it gives me exactly what I'm looking for. It gives me that nice throat punch, a good feeling in my chest, and that's really kept me off of cigarettes, uh, mainly this creamy tobacco flavor by Solace. It is a phenomenal, phenomenal flavor, and uh, I've been heavily impressed with them. So that's really really helped me out. Um, obviously, I have my the bigger boxes, like I have a, a Fuchai two three with uh, BFT Omega. Um, I still enjoy a nice hot like big vape every once in a while um, but generally I vape creamy flavors uh, creamy flavors or, or tobacco flavors like I really enjoy drip witch and uh, burnout by uh, checkered flag is another one of the flavors it's a banana pudding that I'm a fan of same with the lug nuts I prefer the lug nuts a little more which is the graham cracker crust with a hint of cinnamon uh, if you mix the two together they're actually really good they make like an excellent um, b uh, banana cream pie flavor and uh, I'm a big fan of cream pies, so I really like that. Um, but I do enjoy all of the Drip Witch flavors. Uh, strawberry the most, Butter Pecan the second. The blueberry's really good too, it's super strong blueberry. But So I'm normally like a creamy vapor. Um, you know, I'm definitely one to try new mods and try new stuff. Uh, like at the time of this video, I just bought one of these today, Soren Drip. It's pretty cool, I'm pretty impressed with it. I did a review, it's actually the last video you see on here. I did a review with it, I've been vaping it more and more. It takes a little while for the flavor to break in. It didn't really have a ton of flavor when I first got it, um, but it's been breaking in more and more, and I, f I feel like it, it definitely takes longer than any other device, but the flavor is there, and it's just such a nice, sleek little, I mean, this thing's tiny. It is, it is small, so I think that's really neat. It fits right in your pocket. But, uh, yeah, I mean, other than that, everything else you already know from the first one. I've been working at Mad Vapes for a few years. Um, and uh, worked in a ton of different locations. I've worked with Jeremy the entire time, for the most time in Statesville. See him super busy. <laughs> but uh, we mainly worked together, and then I worked in Salisbury for a long time when I first started, and I've worked in all the way from Indian Trail, I think High, High Point Indian Trail. Um, university. I don't know if I've ever worked in university. Yeah, Thomas was going to university for a while. Um, I've just I've worked in a ton of different locations. Gotten to uh, peruse a lot of North Carolina, and um, I don't think I've worked in any South Carolina locations. But I'm gonna continue to jump around because I'm that awesome. And uh, you know they need me in other stores to make sure people are doing the jobs right. It's totally not why they need me there. I'm just full of crap. But uh, yeah, and I you know home base of Statesville. I've been I've really mainly done most of my work in Statesville, and that's the crowd that I've grown to enjoy and and talk to and deal with i know a lot of people in this town uh just through vaping and you know it's really done a lot for me besides helping me quit so i'm super appreciative of what i have uh if you have any questions you know what to do